All right, I'm doing an episode of cooking with corn and I'm going to make breaded chicken with mashed potatoes and some other stuff. Um, or as we say in Plotich, I duck the clops with, oh, there's it. What do we call mashed potatoes? Echotten. Some echotten. Mom, how do you say mashed potatoes? Fien je drak de echotten. Fien je drak de echotten. Is that really it? I feel like there's a, we'll come back to this. For, we got food to make. Some frozen chicken, so great start really. My sous chef is hanging out over there uh, that I'm getting guidance from. <laughs> yeah, maybe it's a blessing in disguise that it's frozen. It cuts a little easier. Now while my sous chef finishes cutting my meat for me, I'm going to get the ingredients ready. A little almond milk to stretch these eggs further. Some flour as well. And then my bread crumbs at the end. And then chef's secret, a little lemon zest for flavor on the outside amongst the breadcrumbs. Now let the operation begin. Right, wet hand, dry hand. That way I don't mix the two up. All right. Dry hand, wet hand. Now that I have once again shown my sous chef how to make the breaded chicken, <laughs> I'm moving on to the potatoes, giving them a peel. Struggling a little there. It's moments like this, I can't just step in and save you. I gotta let you figure it out for yourself. <laughs> uh, now back to the meat once more. Oh, perfect. And just give this stuff a nice gentle little fry. Flip these babies over. Oh, look at that. Nice and golden brown. You're chopping up potatoes. All right, wonderful, thank you. Potatoes are boiling. Sous chef has taken over the meat now. And I'm gonna do a little side dish of mushrooms. Chop up a little greens while I'm at it. I've got some parsley here. Add a little color to the plate, can't all be browns and beiges. Tomato. Chop, chop, chop. We're, uh, we're also on a bit of a time crunch here. We've got 20 minutes. We've got, uh, we've got a sibling to feed who's got uh, work to get back to. Needless to say, I won't be working in a professional kitchen anytime soon. I don't like the stress. As the person who once was a professional chef left from behind the camera. <laughs> uh, I also feel like there might be a greater uh, understanding of why we pre-make food for cooking shows now. <laughs> I know! There's so much to do! You see, Gordon Ramsay's been lying to us. Woo, our potatoes. A little oil in here. Moving on to the mushies. In with my mushies. I think I'm going to have to do this in two goes. A little smoked paprika. 
for some flavorings. Watch out, Gordon Ramsay. There's a new chef in town. He's got a show called Cooking with Corn. <laughs> These portobellos don't need a lot, do they? You're going to want to hit them with a fair bit more salt. Mm -hmm. Plus, um, really juices a lot, which the salt actually adds to. I give them just a little bit more on, on a high heat. Just, like, just watch though, because your cast iron can get super hot. As a chef, I'm humble enough to get second opinions. Woo! <laughs> Ooh, my mom. Oh. Ooh, oh boy, things are getting hectic in this kitchen. So while mom makes some gravy, I mean, while my sous chef makes me some gravy, I'm gonna make a quick vinaigrette for our, our salad here. Oh boy, we're getting a lot of smoke in here. We're gonna have to air this out. Olive oil in there. Uh, oh, oh, mom, watch your hands. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. A little pepper in here. A touch of salt. Squeeze a mustard. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right, take two. Uh, grainy Dijon mustard. We'll have to clean up afterwards. It's all getting a little hair-brained around here. <laughs> I mean, it smells delicious, and I'm looking forward to my gourmet cooked meal. Uh huh. I just didn't know there was going to be entertainment preceding you. <laughs> ah! All right. So, final meal is some breaded chicken. A Dr. Klops, uh, mashed potatoes. We're still not certain what we call it, but we're saying Fingemulde Echotten for now. Echotten Brie. Echotten Brie. Yes. Oh, there yeah. we go. A little uh, Mennonite style gravy, which is basically just cream and what? Cream and uh, fat browning. Schmontfat. There we go. Yes. Schmontfat. Wow, you really are feeling the pressure. <laughs> I know. I'm losing it. Uh, some uh, sautéed portobellos with a little smoked paprika and salt. Very non-Mennonite. Mm-hmm. We're going off course here. And then even further off course is a light version of a tabbouleh salad. I'm not sure how I feel about eating on camera. <laughs> you know, I try. <laughs> you know, you know like, we got a natural hound. <laughs> I'm gonna point to that you like. <laughs> While I eat my lunch. <laughs> Before I have a performance review at work. Performance review? Mm -hmm. oh.